Utopia is a story about a genius scientist who made horrible viruses. Utopia is real. What movies and shows are in the DNA of Utopia? There are a lot of movies and TV shows we can compare this to. I think from episode one, Gillian continues to throw the show on its head. Audiences won't know what hit them from what direction. You know, I thought it's really ripe time for a conspiracy thriller. And in fact, I pitched this as it's Marathon Man meets Goonies. Now that sounds like a great idea. I took my cues a lot from all those great 70s paranoia thrillers. All the president's men that, you know, search for the truth. All we've got are pieces. We can't seem to figure out what the puzzle is supposed to look like. A little bit of close encounters of the third kind just is sort of, you know, should you believe this person or should you not? Um, I love parallax view, certainly. You're telling me that you alone can uncover what all these agencies couldn't. Maybe. We talked about um, the parallax view. There was one, that was one. Uh, and then there was another uh, one. It was a Michael Caine movie. And how did you pick on me? It had to do with sort of mind control. And uh, and I think there's a bit of a cult vibe that goes on, mm. too. That sounds a little precarious. You know, one of my favorite parts of this show is kind of the treasure hunt aspect and looking for clues. And I love things like that, like Indiana Jones. X marks the spot. I would say it's Stranger Things a little sci-fi conspiracy things are not as they seem meets quentin tarantino there's some absurd violence and kind of a wicked dark sense of humor throughout the whole thing oh you guys like to tell jokes and giggle and kid around huh somebody described it as the walking dead mm -hmm. meets goonies okay. and as a huge walking dead fan of course i i penned myself as the daryl of utopia <laughs> <laughs> about me <laughs> but after thinking a little bit more strongly about it i kind of feel like the guy who had a beard and wore a flower shirt and was helping mm. fix the van that's more wilson wilson although i i'd, I'd still just i'd like to be daryl send your choice i feel like there's a little like at least in the beginning like some spielbergian flavor you know but i guess that would sort of fall under the goonies umbrella down here, it's our time. It's our time down here. For some reason, like Willy Wonka comes to mind. Like, <laughs> yeah. yeah. There's a little bit of like Mission Impossible for me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Anybody listening to this is going to be like, what the hell are they talking about? <laughs> what is this show? I think it includes a lot of things and, and kind of builds this story together really well.